The Washington State Cougars ended up in the East region of the NCAA tournament, which landed them in Denver. Just a drive of more than ten th or more than a thousand miles, rather, but a homecoming for a couple of people. Sports director Dennis Patton has official Cougar coverage tonight, live from Denver. Dennis. Yeah, our set truck driver Rob Davis might think it's ten thousand miles driving because he had to do that. But for most Cougar fans, it's about a thousand miles. For a couple of members of the Washington State Cougar team, it's not a thousand miles. It's home. The Cougars went through their final preparations today. Many of the Cougars have never been in Denver and certainly never played a game in the Pepsi Center. That's not the case for David Harveling and Caleb Forrest. While neither grew up in the city of Denver, they are both Colorado natives. And the ability to play an NCAA tournament game or two in their home state, well, that's big to these two Cougars. I'm glad just because a lot of my uh, friends and family can just make the short drive and uh, it's, just a, it's a blessing to be here. It's a great opportunity. We noticed that we were a four seed first and then we noticed that we were going to be in Denver second and then we noticed that we were playing Winthrop and usually like last year we noticed who we were playing in our seed first and so we were extreme, we had high hopes um, definitely praying that we'd be up here. <laughs> And they are, and you can hear the game from Denver on 920 KXLY. Bud will have the call for you tomorrow afternoon as the Cougars into back-to-back -to -back tournaments in the NCAA.